We'll start with the Mustard R43 size 12 dry fly hook. We have Shear Olive 40 naught. Let me just attach our tying thread and go back over the abdomen. Get rid of that. Back to there. Then what we need is some super fine dubbing. We want this to be thin at the top, the dubbing noodle to be thin at the top and get thicker as it goes down. So we just start it at the top like so. We'll slide that up and just catch it in with a couple of turns before I twist the rest of it. Okay, once it's twisted we then can take our rotary vise if we have one. You can wrap it as a normal but I want a segmented body here. So we just go up the body. You can see it getting thicker as it goes towards the thorax. And that will do us there. So what we do now is just ease out the dubbing like so and tie that off. Don't trim away this dub in here because we want this to go in between the wings later. Tiny bit of brown super fine dubbing for the beginning of the thorax. There we go. Then we need some waterfowl flank. This is teal. We need to strip off all this fluff at the bottom and we need to trim off the stem. We need to prepare it like this. Take a nozzle from a UV resin bottle and we pull the first wing through. These wings should be short on the caddis fly. So I'll turn that over so you can see better. I place on the first wing. These need to be a little shorter than the front wings. Remove that and just check our wings okay. Yeah. And we can just secure it a little better before you go all the way forward. We can remove all that. back up into the wing then we take the edge of the fibres here just a couple and we make the wings oops let me turn that round for you we do the same on this side good. Then we need a little bit more brown super fine. And we'll fold over our wing case. We need to fold that back again. Just go up, keep that out of the way and we need our second wing which we tie in exactly the same as the first. 
Okay, both the wings are in now. So what we want now is just to remove these. Don't throw these away, we want two of them. And we'll just place there. Fold them. Let's remove those. We fold these over forward. We take a tiny bit of the brown super fine again. Oops, get that out of the way. We can remove these actually now they're just getting in the way. Just trim these off the wings. super fine. And we pull this over, centralize it again. Trim off that. Give it a whip finish. What I like to do then is I bend these up give it a whip finish underneath on the underside of them. Just to keep them up. There we are. Trim off that. Let's position the wings. And there we have it. The fluttering caddis. If you enjoy the videos please like, subscribe and thanks for watching.